Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad and welcome back to Smash Bros Ultimate. There's a few more things I quickly want to do before I pretty much send the rest of this game that I have not completed into maybe streaming area. Which I probably might have already done by the time this goes up, so. But anyway, I'm going to grab all of these spirits. I didn't even read any of them with the actual names and... Um... Powers, but also I don't think it's worth doing, I guess, for every single one. It, it, I'll try to get as many spirits on screen that I can, uh, but I can't guarantee. But anyway, one of the last things... Oh, there's actually quite a few things, aren't there? Okay, so it's going to be a few more episodes yet. Anyway, plus also all, all the other things. Playing with Amiibo. You can use Amiibo figures sold separately to interact with your game. Touch them to the... NFC touchpoint, and they'll appear as special fighters. The amiibo, amiibo will become a figure, figure player, FP, and join the battle. As FPs fight and learn, their abilities and personalities grow, slowly turning them into a one-of-a-kind fighter. If you have an amiibo, go ahead and scan it, even if it isn't a fighter amiibo. You can still receive a reward. I have no idea what to do with this. I guess I'll just scan my Mario. Yep, this is fine. Just go. Enter a nickname. What? 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 Who do you think I am? Um... <laughs> it's- it's a Mario. Mer- 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 Mario. <laughs> Mario. <laughs> Mario. Mario. Okay, remove. Okay. I want it to be... Ooh. Select fighter color. I kind of want it to be... There's not really any great colors. I, I wish you could customize the colors more. Mario. Are these settings okay? Uh, hang on. It has to be Mario because of it being a Mario Amiibo apparently. Um, I'll do the warrior color. Okay. Oh my goodness, I can level it up. You can level up amiibo that have become FPs. Inheriting a spirit's abilities will strengthen the FP. FPs can receive experience points and learn s skills, send them to fight and they'll learn how to fight. What? Select a spirit you'd like to inherit from. I don't know if I like the sound of that. Does it, does it, wait, does this mean I can clone a spirit? Is that what that means? Also by level, no, by, by offensive rating. Um. I guess this is the highest. Also, I got Darkon and uh, Galeem leveled up all the way. Impact Run could be good. I just don't know if this is going to overwrite or get rid of the previous spirit. You will lose the spirit. Okay, never mind. Let's not do that. Let's send on a journey. Send your FP to do a battle throughout the internet. Oh my goodness. Fighter Color Learn. Um, no, we're going to just smash, I guess. I have no idea. I've seen this option whenever you set up a, a, th a thing, but also, anyway. This also gives me a chance to look at some of the changes that I've made to some of my maps. There's also two DK alternates now, which are different, le like, they're different heights on the screen, but they're, they're the same stage as far as I can tell. It's a little bit hard to be the same, but anyway, let's, let's have a look at them. So, obviously, DK Frozen is... Um, it's the same level as close as I can get. I guess I'm player two. Also, I want to do a team battle. And let's go against some computers. Come on, give me what I want. There we go. 
guess that will do well. <laughs> there we go. I'm going to laugh at that every time I see that. But yeah, whenever you have a thing, you can also go FP if you want to do that. Which means I could also do my other two amiibo, I guess. But also, I'm going to I'm gonna hold off on that and maybe do that separately. Let's see what this is like. But yeah, DK level with ice, so it's all slippery. Which does make some weird stuff happen with the blocks, because they will fall off the, the things. And then they'll just slide off if they get broken off completely, so you don't actually need to destroy everything before they just go. Oh my goodness. Also, Mayo just leveled up, so that's good. If we can knock this down, that'd be great so we can get the middle platform back. I don't think we gonna do it so I'm just gonna blow this up over here and that should clear up everything it's it's very different with the ice physics everywhere on this level which is very cool that you can have a level that you made and then do it differently and it's just so different but anyway it also is interesting that you can have the blocks slide off the screen possibly pushing off any other fighters with them oh Mario don't die Mario I'm sorry I'm sorry Mario oh he's fine oh no he's not well, that's a shame. Also, I need to change the music for this, I think. I mean, it's a good song, but I just don't think it fits. Actually, maybe it does. No. I I, I I need to actually go over the songs for each of the things, actually. Ow. Come on, Mayo, you got this. Come on, Mario, you've got this. As I mess up everything. Oh boy. Oh boy, Ness, what have you done to- No. Who? I'm so confused. Link. Toon Link. Goodbye, Toon Link. Get gone. Or not. That's fine too. Ah. Uh... Just gonna knock that around. Get you. Good. Come on, Mayo. You've nearly got your thing. You're also level, level 5 already, so that's good. Also, I, I, I slightly slimmed down the blocks, that are the main platforms that don't fall. Uh, down from 4 to 3. I actually have all of the, the notes that I had recreating the levels. Because once you know how to adjust the size of the blocks that, that they fall when they need, you want them to, and all that. It's just 3x5 uh, for the top one. No, hang on. 3x9 three, three for the regular blocks. I'm really bad at this. 9x5 for the top block here. Uh, uh, what's the next one? Actually, no. I'm still getting it wrong, aren't I? Let me finish this fight and then I'll look at the notes of the block sizes. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm actually okay with the song, with the blocks falling off screen like that. It just works. And also because it's a uh, ice level-ish, I guess, it kind of works with that. Except even though it's not a, an ice level song, it's actually a flower fields I think. Which is funny. Oh my goodness, ba bomb. If I can just... Nope, that's not good. Ah! It does work, kind of, as a nice level though. Which is something I kind of like. Is taking an existing level and then changing the theme. I like that one video that I saw. I can't... Remember the username at the moment, but they made the Bowser's in the Dark World level as an ice level, and that's really cool to watch them do it. Come on. Can I please? Okay, good. Maybe. Oh, that's not good. Oh, Mar Mar Mario, no! It's just me now. This is not going to end well. Nice. 
key that. No, okay, never mind. I thought I got rid of the assist trophy by doing that, but no, you can't get rid of the assist trophy by having it fall screen. I'm gonna die at this rate. No. Oh my goodness. Can I face the right way, please? I'm gonna lose because I don't have enough points. And they have all the points, so. Oh, but anyway, that's how FP spirits work. I might just use them in general a bit now, actually. Just for whatever fight to do. Level 10, that's actually pretty good. That's, pretty, that's a pretty good start. I guess they, he was going against level 9s, but anyway. I'm going to back out of this for now. And I might even... Ah, I just want to return to the Mebo menu. I have two more things I want to add. Uh, display stats. Okay, that's the stats. Save changes to Amiibo. I need to scan it again. That's cool though that you can do that. And I guess that means that if I take it to a different profile, it will still have uh, the, the information for the Amiibo. Which is cool, actually. Just do that. Enter nickname. Uh, link. Toon. Uh, Link's Awakening Link. Uh, perfect. <laughs> it's a, it's a, mm, it's not really a long, <laughs> hang on. Dropping things. That's how you spell Link, right? No, um... I just... I just... I just want it to be... The... The name of the amiibo. By default. I, I don't really want to rename... My amiibo. Hey look, it's Link! And I want him to look... Like the fierce de deity, because obviously that's the best option. There he is. And I guess we could send on a journey, just to see what that does. You can use the internet to send an FP on a training journey. They all get stronger by gaining experience doing battle. This requires a paid membership of Nintendo Switch Online. It'll take time for an FP to return from a journey. Be sure to keep the Nintendo Switch system charged. The playtime calculated by the Nintendo Switch parental controls apps will include the journey. Well, I can't do that, so I'm gonna have to back out. Save changes to my amiibo. It's there. There we go. Remove from amiibo, and now for my inkling, just quickly. There he is. I think I'm gonna keep the same color, so it, uh, like, same color as my amiibo, so. BT10 spling. Apparently that's what I said to, wall. that looks different. <laughs> that looks so different. Gonna do that. There we go. Nope, come, come on, come on, don't do that, please. Uh... Inklun. 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 You know, Inklun. Registering. Okay. There we go. And then put away. It's really cool that they did this. I guess I can use that a whole lot more often now as well. Let's back out. I wonder if it counts it as a human player in tournaments. Anyway, let's go to Squad Strike. Because it's quite interesting. As far as I can tell. Because you have teams of fighters, but you swap out, as far as I can tell. Elimination, best of... Yeah, I'm gonna just go tag team. Uh, let's... Also go over to some different ones. I kinda wanna do lava rapids. 
just to show what I changed about it. So, I could do five and five or three on three. I kind of want to do five versus five. Okay, so let's select Kirby Me. Oh, can I not add? Can I not add? Because it'd be really cool to. Oh no, I can. Cool, so we can actually switch out these to be my amiibo fighters. It's actually really cool. And then the last one, I guess I'll just make it me again, probably. Um. Well, maybe I can't do that. I guess I can't. Oh, no, I can. I just have to move this. But I might also start... Oh, I can't do that, though. Okay, game, I see what you're trying to say here. <laughs> Hang on. Uh, I guess I'll just take Ganondorf. Although I was kind of tempted to make it a CPU. No, I'll do... I'll do... Me as a random... No. Maybe? Uh, duh. Choices. Actually, I think I'll switch out Ganondorf and Kirby. Like that. Cool, let's make everyone CPU on that side. Kind of want to turn them up a little bit, except maybe not since my my FPs aren't extremely strong yet. Okay, let's go. Squad strike. Ah, uh, choose order. <laughs> what are you, what are you, who do you think I am? Ah! Random. <laughs> I think I picked... Okay, first, second, third, fourth, fifth. I don't know how that works. I'm assuming that it will always have one of each player do their match. Anyway, let's go. We have our lineup. Starting off, I believe, is Inkling versus Pichu. So this is what I've changed. <laughs> this is gonna be a mess. This is what I changed Lava Rapids to be like. Because I put in... I made the plat platforms larger and less of them. Uh, but I put a spring inside of all of them. So that they always stay flat. Which will be... It, it's, it's not that much of a difference, but it's... It's something. I may have made a mistake by picking this map because computers have no idea what to do about it. And I think Link is currently losing if we're counting by percentage because that's all we can count by. He's leveled up though, so that's good. I don't know how he leveled up. But anyway. Maybe just the AI in general just learns from the maps, how to play. Oh my goodness. Link, no, he leveled up. That's our boy, he leveled up. Also, he's in the lead now. Somehow. This is so chaotic. I did increase the speed at which that they slide down the slope as well, I think. Just a little bit. But they still don't know how to fight in midair. Because that's mostly what you have to do in this. Oh my goodness, he's inside the block. This was this was broken before because any time that this map came up, the blocks wouldn't move off. So I had to adjust a few things. That's why there's the little thing over the top of the ice blocks. It's just to keep it inside on both sides and only let one out at a time. But anyway. It was just a little bit weird watching computers fight each other. And have no platforms, basically. There was only one spot on the screen that you could stand, and then when Bowser had his final smash, he just hit there on the screen, and you always hit. It was interesting, though, when somebody won, be or almost won, because they stayed alive, but they were bouncing back and forth underneath the block, and it came down to a deathmatch. Unfortunately, I believe they lost, though, in the deathmatch, so... But it was cool. Link's at level 5. I might even change the names of my Amiibo things at some point, if I can find better names. Cooler names. I don't know. I don't know, like... There's ten... ten... There's only ten digits. 
so 10 characters. This is a very long match. Well, they've lost one of their fighters, so next is Ganondorf. I'm third in line. <laughs> also, I, th I think it actually swapped out and put Link in the back? No, he's still in, right. I, I forgot about that. Come on. I'm actually okay with Link falling out just for a change. Also, they have a Ganondorf. Oh, also this is me, because I have two of me. This is not going to work very well with two Ganondorfs. Because n neither of us can live, but also I can know how to jump, so... Joke's on you. I'm going to win because I can actually play to live instead of playing to the death. Ow. Please. No. Okay. As long as I just survive up here, we should just win by default. So. Nice. Almost. Please. Nope. I need to stop doing my up smash because after you do an up smash, you can't jump again. As is what my understanding of it is. Ho, oh, close. Two bad things. You gotta come down, please. You can't fight me when you're up there. The computer is learning that there is no way to win. I'm kind of tempted to just quit. Because this is just going to take forever otherwise. I need to do a different map. Let's try that again. Does it still have the same things? Also, I want elimination. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to create my own rule set. Uh, tag team. Elimination. Actually, that's interesting. The winner will start a new battle with the next opponent. That's also, yeah, that's, that's interesting. Also, I want to just set that up a little bit. Probably. Maybe. Or maybe just elimination. With five minutes is probably... Good. It's probably good to have some time limit. Uh, final smash meter. Spirits off. CPU levels can stay a little, little low. Um, items. I'm going to turn that up because I'm crazy like that. Number of stages one. Stage morph off. Stage hazards off. Victor's Recovery 30. That's interesting. I guess that's good for in um, tag team, probably. We don't go out. I'm going to turn the launch rate down to zero. Or one, one times. Pausing off. Score display on. Show damage. Better. Okay, now, let's not do that one with computer players ever. Let's do Blender, I guess, because I did make a few adjustments. You can basically just set the, um, the, um, uh, you can set the, uh, the blocks in the air to whatever you want, even any shape, basically, as long as they, is it's chaotic, chaotic. You can just make it as chaotic as you want, so... Anyway... There's all of our, our stuff in there, and then I'm gonna put Kirby in last. I guess it doesn't matter, it's gonna shuffle us anyway, so... Make everyone CPU, let's go. I imagine this would be cool with all humans. Okay. Mario is up first. Against Peach. Uh, if you skip, your FPs won't gain experience. Why? I think I almost skipped the battle. I wasn't planning on skipping the battle. But anyway. Ready, go. I also put a little platform down next to the portal so that there's a lot 
a lot more likelihood of characters surviving. And the sides are now, they have no flat bits on top, and they're made of the bouncy, um, bouncy rubber. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is still chaotic. But it's a little bit more manageable, I guess, than uh, Lava Rapids, because the computers can actually do something. I say that, but they haven't actually done anything yet, so... Come on, please. <laughs> Mayo almost got a hit in. Oh no. Peach got hit. hit got hits. Oh, Mayo. What have you done? Oh, grab the items. Grab the items. Grab the items. What are you doing? Why are you recovering? Oh my goodness. Somebody will get a hit in eventually. This is why DK is my best map. Well, best stage. Because it's an actual stage. There's kind of a balance to Smash Bros. custom stages. Of chaos and... and... no chaos. What's the opposite of chaos? Order? Order. You have to have the right balance of order and chaos. Just like real life. Nice. Got a hit in. So I did attempt to make the platforms at the bottom rotate, but that will end up with the whole the main platform falling into the void, which is not what I want, especially because it makes it really hard for it to respawn. I kind of wanted to uh, make the blocks kind of make their own platforms, I guess build their own level, but they, yeah, it's a little bit all over the place. Half the time is down, and Peach is currently winning. Mayor Yo has 42%. Peach is at 18, but they might have a chance to actually hit each other, maybe. Oh my goodness, this would also be good. I guess my the 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 crazy maps are better for actual human players, or rather than computers, because computers have no idea how moving objects work when they just have gravity. Uh oh. Come on. She's gonna recover, maybe? Is she actually gonna recover properly? Probably. Unless one of the blocks pulls her down. She's really not wanting to get out of there. Can't just go into the portal. Oh, the portal's covered up! I think they can still use it, though. Pretty sure. But Peach just has no idea how to use it. There we go. Figured it out. Come on, Mario. Come on, Mario. Oh, grab the gun. Grab the gun. Grab the gun. No, why are you not grabbing the gun? Also, just don't get close to Peach because she's just up attacking through the platform. Ah, blocks. <laughs> Man, this is taking a long time. I'm going to have to just select better matches when there's just just computers please recover thank you <sighs> they barely hit each other the entire round chaos is good until nothing ever happens <laughs> There's a smash ball there if somebody wants to grab that. The smash meters are getting pretty high as well. Oh, Maro, ma ma you're okay. Please. <laughs> Please. It'd be interesting to watch. No, nah, maybe not. <laughs> maybe not. Just 24 hour live streams of this just would be too much for me to handle. What are you doing? <gasps> Oh, Peach wins because Ma Mario jumped off the edge. Well, I guess something happened within the time limit. Hey, look, it's me versus Peach. Okay, cool.
Also, I'm pretty sure it's going to be the same map. So as long as I don't die now, we might actually have a chance of winning. Ready, go. Oh my goodness. Portal it imme immediately. But I guess that's a good thing if she's down there. Also, if I can get some kind of assist trophy or something, and maybe actually get a chance at hitting her, it could be good. Good. Stuff is actually happening. It's crazy. Oh, don't push me through there. Oh, hey, Mushroom. <laughs> it came back. That's actually really cool that it came back. Oh, there's a bob -omb in there. I don't know where it went, but I think it's gone. Oh, 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 my assist trophy. Oh, it's in there. It's in there. Oh, there it goes. Maybe it fell into the thing? Maybe it fell into the thing? No. But also I'm gonna take that. Oh, Pokeball? Nope. Ah. There's, I can't get the item. I'm playing it and it's still not having much actual fighting happening because the computer just is not staying out of the ground. Nope, miss. That's okay, I have... It's it's okay, I have time, I have time. They're at 60%. I just need to launch them a few more times. I almost at 100%. So theoretically, I can win this fight. I can actually win the fight. Give me that, nope, now oh, it's gone. And I'm down here, I'm gonna grab that if I can. Go back in the portal. Pokeball. Give me the Pokeball. Everything's calm. There is a few a few occasional calm points in time that can happen. Also, baseball. Very nice. Can't get that anymore though. See if I can actually get Nope. There she goes. Hey, we're both gold. Kind of. Also, the Pokemon is just wobbling all over the place. Can you not recover? Or okay. Also, how did that not activate? How did that not activate? It's almost worth hitting it myself just to activate it. Ah! I'm in here. Oh no! No, 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 no. Okay, I'm fine. Also, how is she at 116 and not launched? Or anything? Should have set the. No, it's it's just weird to, to me that you don't have uh, different levels each time, basically. Okay, 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 okay. Recover if you dare. Oh, I can't can't get in in the hole. There we go. Run away when I was after her. Please, please, no, I need to get over that side. I have my f smash and it's gonna run out at some point. It's just gonna disappear. Go, go, please. Thank you. I should win from this. Also, whenever somebody uses a final smash, that also freezes everything. So that works as well. For that level. Okay, we've got one win. I can also save replay. View it in the vault. Um, let's fight Jigglypuff, I guess. Ready? Okay, I just wish that this was a different level at this point, because I don't know why it would just give me the same level every single time. I guess if it's just to see who can play the best in each, or well, in this level, then that works. Also, this is a p overpowered item, probably, because it's just going to keep going all over the place. Forever. Probably, unless the block falls off the edge. It, it should just keep going, though. I think it'll come back, maybe. Oh, Squid Sisters. That's going to end the round quickly. Because it's making the screen smaller. Please don't crush me. Thank you. Oh my goodness. That is the luckiest assist trophy for that level. Especially if you're going up against a computer. 
We're not going to see any of the other fighters at this point. But I think I want to also switch to a different map again so that's more focused. I just want to see if I can actually win this. I probably can. I didn't start in the thing. Which is interesting. That it could be different for once. Maybe it knew that starting in that position was too powerful. The game is learning. Can I get out of the ground? Thank you. I apparently can get out of the ground, apparently. Also, he's actually doing well. Oh my goodness. Two things that just fell in the void. Ow. We're both actually doing some damage, which is good. If you can stay in the clear area, which is a little bit difficult because it switches back and forth every time the blocks go to the other side. But if you can do that, it actually works out pretty well. Oh, Master Ball. Master Ball is gone. There's also a mushroom. What is he doing? Ow. Take that. I am huge, Kirby. Let's put up a little bit more of a fight that time, which is good. Okay, Pichu. Let's see how you go. Ready? I'm gonna Pichu. you. Come on. Come on. Pichu. 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 You can't get away from me. So you probably want to not stay there forever. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Got it. I got an actual thing. Oh my goodness. What happened? Pichu just... Oh, ended the round so fast. Also, it's... 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 Daisy, which is a Peach Echo fighter. Which means it's going to be basically the same as fighting Peach again. I should definitely try this mode with humans at some point, though. Nope, there goes that item thing. Which usually has another item in it. So what happens if I copy your ability? Oh, I just bring out a toad. Cool. Ah, get up. Ow. Here I am. Oh my goodness. Everything's exploding. Everything's exploding. Help. Help. Everything's exploding. You're also, you're also underneath the everything right now, so I can't really get to you. There we go. Oh, you just went back up. How dare you. I'm gonna go through the portal because that's a lot faster than anything else that I could possibly do. Come on. Come on. Get it. Get it. Activate. Nope. 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 And go up around this side, please. Oh, it just activates the thing automatically. Cool. If you're back on the ground. That works. Wow. <laughs> cool. But yeah, this is this is what this mode is like, where you actually have to team up, or, like, each person has a chance after they lose. Like, after somebody else loses, then you have to pass the con controller teamwork to somebody else. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Maybe I do. Anyway, 800 gold for finishing a squad strike. Oh, I kind of want to do a... Yeah, no. I don't want to return to the amiibo menu. But I have to resync Mario's because he leveled up. I 
Anyway, I might try to do another one of those on a better map. But anyway, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.